The Gupta Empire was one of the most powerful and influential empires in ancient India. It was founded by Sri Gupta in 320 AD and it lasted until 550 AD. During this time, the Gupta dynasty ruled over much of northern and central India with great political stability, military power, and cultural and artistic achievement. The Gupta Empire was a time of great intellectual and artistic flourishing and it left an indelible mark on Indian history and culture. The Gupta period was characterized by a strong system of governance with a well-organized administration and a system of local government that allowed for regional autonomy. The empire was ruled by powerful kings who were supported by a council of ministers and advisors. The Guptas were great patrons of the arts and literature and many famous works of Sanskrit literature were written during this period. The Gupta Empire was also a time of great scientific and mathematical achievement with famous mathematicians such as Aryabhata making significant contributions to the field of mathematics. The Gupta Empire was known for its religious tolerance and inclusiveness. Although Hinduism was the predominant religion, Buddhism and Jainism also flourished during this period. The Guptas were great patrons of Hinduism and supported the building of many magnificent temples throughout their empire. However, the Guptas were also tolerant of other religions and this led to a great social and cultural diversity in India during the Gupta period. The Gupta Empire was also a time of great economic prosperity. The empire had a thriving agricultural sector and trade and commerce flourished, with goods being traded throughout India and beyond. The Guptas established a strong system of taxation and trade, which helped to finance their military campaigns and cultural achievements. Despite its many achievements, the Gupta Empire eventually declined and was overrun by the Huns. However, its legacy continues to be celebrated and admired by historians and scholars alike. The Gupta period was a time of great intellectual and artistic flourishing, and its legacy is a testament to the power and influence of ancient India. The Gupta Empire was a powerful and influential empire that ruled over much of northern and central India from 320 to 550 AD. It was founded by Sri Gupta, who was succeeded by his son Gadatkacha. The empire reached its height under the rule of Chandragupta I, who expanded the empire and established it as a major power in ancient India. The Gupta dynasty continued to rule until it was eventually overrun by the Huns. The Gupta Empire was characterized by a strong system of governance. The empire was divided into provinces, each of which was governed by a governor appointed by the king. The governors were responsible for collecting taxes, maintaining law and order, and defending the province against external threats. The king was supported by a council of ministers and advisors who helped him make decisions on matters of state. The Gupta Empire was known for its religious tolerance and inclusiveness. Although Hinduism was the predominant religion, Buddhism and Jainism also flourished during this period. The Guptas were great patrons of Hinduism and supported the building of many magnificent temples throughout their empire. However, the Guptas were also tolerant of other religions and this led to a great social and cultural diversity in India during the Gupta period. The Gupta Empire was a time of great intellectual and artistic flourishing. The Guptas were great patrons of the arts and literature and many famous works of Sanskrit literature were written during this period. The Gupta period is often referred to as a golden age of Indian literature and many of the works produced during this time continue to influence Indian culture to this day. The Gupta Empire was also a time of great scientific 
and mathematical achievement, famous mathematicians such as Aryabhata made significant contributions to the field of mathematics and the concept of zero was first developed during this period. The Gupta Empire also made significant contributions to the field of astronomy with the famous astronomer Varahamihira making important discoveries in the field. The Gupta Empire was known for its military power. The Gupta army was well organized and highly disciplined and it was able to conquer much of northern and central India. The Guptas also had a strong navy which allowed them to control the trade routes along India's coastlines. The Gupta Empire was able to maintain its military dominance through a system of alliances and diplomacy as well as through the use of advanced military technology such as war elephants and iron weapons. The Gupta Empire was also a time of great economic prosperity. The empire had a thriving agricultural sector and trade and commerce flourished, with goods being traded throughout India and beyond. The Guptas established a strong system of taxation and trade, which helped to finance their military campaigns and cultural achievements. Despite its many achievements, the Gupta Empire eventually declined and was overrun by the Huns. The Huns were a group of nomadic invaders who were able to defeat the Guptas through a combination of military force and political cunning. However, the legacy of the Gupta Empire continues to be celebrated and admired by historians and scholars alike. The Gupta period was a time of great intellectual and artistic flourishing and its legacy is a testament to the power and influence of ancient India. Gupta Empire was its system of governance which was characterized by a decentralized administration that gave significant autonomy to local rulers. This allowed for greater flexibility and responsiveness to local needs while also ensuring that the central government retained overall control. The system was based on the principle of Dharma, which emphasized the importance of duty and responsibility. The Gupta rulers were known for their fair and just governance and their commitment to maintaining law and order in the empire. The Gupta empire was also notable for its advances in medicine and healthcare. The ancient Indian medical system, known as Ayurveda, was further developed during this period and the Guptas made significant contributions to the field. They established hospitals and medical colleges and the famous physician Chiraka wrote the Chiraka Samhita, one of the most important texts in the history of Ayurvedic medicine. The Guptas were also known for their expertise in surgery and many complex surgical procedures were performed during this time. Another significant aspect of the Gupta Empire was its architecture and art. The Guptas were great patrons of art and culture and their period is considered a golden age of Indian art. The Gupta style of architecture was characterized by the use of brick, and stone and many beautiful temples and monuments were built during this time. The most famous example is the rock-cut temple complex at Ellora, which contains many magnificent sculptures and carvings. The Gupta Empire was also a time of great social and cultural transformation. The caste system was further developed during this period, with the Brahmins gaining greater power and influence. However, the Guptas were also known for their support of social mobility and merit-based systems which allowed for individuals from lower caste to rise to positions of power and influence. Women also played an important role in Gupta society and many notable women such as the famous scholar Gargi Vacheknavi and the Queen Ditta of Kashmir made significant contributions to Indian culture and society. One of the most significant legacies of the Gupta Empire was its contributions to literature and scholarship. The period is often referred to as the golden age of Indian literature and saw the development of many important works in the fields of poetry, drama, philosophy, and science. The most famous literary works of the Gupta period include the plays of Kalidasa such as Shakuntala and Megadud, which are considered among the greatest works of classical Indian literature. The Gupta period also saw the development of important scientific works such as the Aryabhatiya by the astronomer and mathematician Aryabhata. 
Religious pluralism was another notable feature of the Gupta Empire. Although the rulers were Hindu, they were tolerant of other religions and allowed for the flourishing of Buddhism and Jainism. The famous Buddhist scholar and philosopher Vasubandhu lived during the Gupta period and his works had a profound influence on the development of Buddhist philosophy. The Gupta Empire also saw the development of the Gupta script, which was an important milestone in the history of Indian writing. However, despite its many achievements, the Gupta Empire eventually declined and was eventually conquered by the Huns in the 6th century. The reasons for its decline are complex, but some historians point to factors such as external invasions, economic instability, and internal power struggles. The decline of the Gupta Empire marked the end of a significant chapter in Indian history, but its legacy continues to inspire and influence Indian culture and society to this day. The Gupta army was known for its advanced military tactics and weapons, which allowed it to successfully repel invasions from neighboring states. The Guptas maintained a powerful standing army, which was well-equipped and well-trained. The empire also employed a sophisticated system of espionage and intelligence gathering, which helped it to stay ahead of its enemies. The economy of the Gupta Empire was also thriving, with trade and commerce playing an important role. The Guptas encouraged the growth of trade and commerce, and their period saw the development of a sophisticated system of trade and commerce across the Indian subcontinent. The empire was connected to major trade routes, which allowed it to engage in trade with other parts of the world. The Guptas also issued a standardized currency which helped to facilitate trade and commerce. The Gupta period was also marked by significant advancements in mathematics and astronomy. The Indian mathematician Aryabhata made significant contributions to the field of mathematics during this period and his works had a profound influence on the development of mathematical thought. The Guptas were also known for their expertise in astronomy and many important astronomical observations were made during this time. The Gupta period saw the development of the decimal system and the concept of zero, which had a profound impact on the development of mathematics and science. The Gupta Empire was a period of great achievement and cultural flourishing in ancient India. Its contributions to art, literature, science, and governance were significant, and its legacy continues to shape Indian culture and society to this day. The Gupta period is often referred to as a golden age of Indian history, and its achievements continue to inspire and influence people around the world. Despite its eventual decline, the Gupta Empire remains an important chapter in the history of India and a testament to the resilience and creativity of human civilization. Hope you enjoyed this video. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel and do hit the bell icon to remain updated about all our future videos. See you all next time.